Did you know that your charcoal fire can power motors when barbecue? A lot of barbecue grills, especially kebab grills, often come with motors that spin the skewers for you. No more standing there flipping each skewer by hand. Just sit back, relax, and let the motor do the work so every skewer cooks evenly without any burnt sides. But here's the problem. Every single one of these grills needs an external power source to run. Some need batteries, some hook up a power bank, and some even need a 110 volt wall socket. I mean, really? Who's lucky to run a power outlet in the middle of nowhere on a camping trip? And it gets even crazier. If those batteries get too close to the fire, you are not just looking at a dead motor. You could be dealing with a fire hazard, or worse, a battery explosion. That's just way too risky for a simple barbecue. What if we could just use the heat from the charcoal itself to power everything? No batteries, no cables, just fire. And that's what we set out to create. Check this out. Yeah, it is a bit rough around the edges right now because it's primarily built to test out our design and tech concepts. But today, I want to show you something really cool: how this little setup uses nothing but charcoal heat to spin skewers. Here is how it works: when we place the lead charcoal onto this aluminum heat plate, the heat gets transferred straight to a power generation module. Inside this black box, it's called a TEG. Its job is to turn heat into electricity. Once that happens, the first thing the power does is to drive this small fan on the side. The fan's there to prevent the TEG from overheating, which also boosts its power efficiency. Then the electricity flows into the motor. As soon as the motor kicks in. It spins the routers, which make the skewers rotate once they are inserted. And our barbecue setup is running with nothing but heat, no batteries, no hassle. But remember, just like I mentioned before, this is still an early version. It's rough around the edges, and there's a lot we're still developing. For example, increasing the portability, adding more utility features, and so on. This is where I could really use your help. As a creator, I'm not just looking into building a product. I want to solve real problems and make life easier for those who could benefit from this. For street vendors, this setup means less time spent constantly checking and turning the skewers. Just load them up and let them rotate evenly on their own, so people have more time to manage other tasks. Especially when they've got a lot of customers, and for home cooks, it takes away the hustle of standing over the grill flipping each skewer by hand. In addition, I'd appreciate it if you could share this video with someone who might be interested. If there are any potential issues, I'd much rather catch them now than having customers discover them later. That's why your input is valuable to me. Whether it's about making the design more practical or adding features that could save time, please let me know in the comments. Last but not least, if you want to stay updated on the progress, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification button. I'll be sharing more updates as we refine the design and get closer to launching the final product. Your support really helps keep this project moving forward. And thanks again for watching.